I'm going to show you how to back up and restore a Windows Print Server configuration. So to start, I'm logged onto my Windows Print Server, and then within Server Manager, I'm going to go to Tools, and then Print Management. Within Print Management, on the left-hand side, we can just double-check we've got our Print Server, and we've got our printer queues, as well as our drivers, and our ports, and any other of our setup. Now to do a backup of the config, you want to right-click the Print Management, and then select Migrate Printers, and in here, we can select export printer queues and printer drivers to a file. We can then press next, select this print server. This will tell us what it's going to back up. So it's going to back up two print queues, these drivers, these processors, and these ports. We can then select next, and then browse, and then select anywhere that we want to back up the files to. So I'll just back them up to the desktop and call it print config backup and then save, and then next, and that will then export all of the files for us. Once that's finished, we can just press finish, and then if I just minimize my print management and come to the desktop, we can see we've got our print config backup, which is a backup of our printer management. So if I come back into print management now, as an example, I'm just gonna restore it to this server. However, you don't have to, you can restore this to another server. So if I just come to my printers and then just delete the print queue, and then I'll delete the driver. And then if I come to ports, I will delete the ports as well. So now all we need to do is, instead of resetting up our new print server or resetting this print server back up, if we come to print management, right click migrate printers. Now instead of exporting the printer queues, we can import. And then all we need to do is just select that file we exported and then press next. That will generate as a list, so it say it's going to restart this print queue, these drivers, these ports. We want to do it to this server. Now we've got a couple of options here. So if any of the information already exists, we can either keep the existing printers that are on this print server, or we can just overwrite whatever is on this print server with this backup. So we can just keep, keep existing printers, or if we want to force it, we can overwrite the existing printers. Then if any of the printers were listed in the directory, it will either relist the ones that were, it will list all of them, or it won't list any of them. I'm just going to leave these at default, and then press next, and that will restore our print server from our backup. Now that's done, we'll just press finish. We can see that we've got our ports back, so it's restored all of our free ports. For the printers, we've now got our print queue back, and the same if we come to drivers, we've got our HP driver. Just to test, we can come back to our warehouse printer, we can see it's got the same details, it's got the same ports it had selected, and if we come back to advanced, we've got our print driver. So that's how to do a backup and restore and a migration of a Windows print server.